In this morning's U.S. Bank Economic 360, the fiscal cliff is a concept we're going to be hearing a whole lot about in the months ahead. Our U.S. Bank investment analyst Jim Russell joins us to tell us what it is and how it could dramatically slow the U.S. economy in 2003. Jim, this is an ominous term, fiscal cliff. Are we talking about another recession here? Well, Brian, uh, good morning. Uh, it is uh, something, as you'd mentioned, that we're going to hear a lot more about as we move toward the end of the year. Uh, will it cause a recession? That jury is out, and I'll explain more in just a second about that. What the fiscal cliff is, is the combination of tax increases that are likely to kick in, into 2013, as well as government spending cuts. Because our uh, recovery is so weak, we're worried a little bit about that combination actually throwing the United States into a possible recession early next year. The timing is really tricky here. We're talking about this fiscal cliff hitting in the first quarter. You've got the election in the fall. I mean, does that just add even more uncertainty to the whole picture? It does. And uh, here we are, uh, November, uh, the first Tuesday in November, of course, will be the election. If things stay the same, and that is no changes are done by uh, the legislative branch or the executive branch, these uh, tax increases and spending cuts will indeed take place. So uh, we don't know if Congress and the president, whoever that person may be, will act in the last month or two of uh, 2013 or if we're likely to go this way. Just to put some numbers around this on how big this is. Our economy is about a $15 trillion economy. These spending cuts and tax increases amount to a little over $500 billion. So for business leaders and investors out there, Brian, we think this is a very uh, tricky time where the markets will probably become nervous and the economy is likely to slow down dramatically in the first quarter of 2013 should, uh, again, Washington not act. When we look at our national debt, the numbers are off the charts. I mean, most of us can't even fathom these kinds of figures. Right. Is this something that we have to uh, kind of get used to, though? Is this a trend that we're going to be dealing with? Brian, you're bringing up a great point here, and that is this is something that I think is a view of the future. Higher taxes, lower spending by Washington. That combination, of course, keeps debt in check. That's probably where we are for uh, the periods ahead. Let me add one other thing. The fiscal cliff looks like it would uh, add a headwind of about 3.5% to GDP. We're growing right now at about 2.5%. So, again, the recession scenario remains operative and possible for early 2013. Jim Russell, we appreciate you and U.S. Bank. Thank you, sir.